Hi everyone, welcome to Salt Lake Central Station here in Salt Lake City, Utah, where today I'm going to be doing a video that I've wanted to do for a while. I just haven't had the opportunity to do it anywhere yet, and that is to beat the record to go to every subway or metro station uh, in a metropolitan area's uh, public transport line. I saw I had a free day here in Salt Lake City and thought, you know what, I'm finally going to do it. I'm going to go for it. I'm going to beat the record to all the Salt Lake City public transport stations. And I looked up what that record was and it doesn't exist. No one's ever tried it. So as long as I get it done, that's the record, supposedly. We're going to be starting from here in Salt Lake Central Station on the Trax Blue Line. This is going to be on the Trax Light Rail Services, the S Line, and the Front Runner. Those are the three trains that come together and make up the Utah Transport Authority sort of uh, rail network here in Salt Lake City. The plan was to start by knocking out the entire blue line before heading to Fashion Place West to transfer to the red line, and get that line done before heading to Central Point Station to get the shorter S line, which isn't shown on this map, but all the maps that I could find that showed it were fairly poor quality, so enjoy this self-made map of the S line. After riding the S line to the end and back to Central Point, the plan was to then knock out the southern stretch of the green line, then make my way back to Murray Central to knock out the purple line called the Front Runner, then get off at Guadalupe Station and finish off the green line, ending at the airport. Thank you for writing UTA. Okay, made it to uh, Draper Town Center. Where's the sign? That is the sign. Draper Town Center on this train. And this train's heading back to Salt Lake City. I need to get on this one. And it leaves in two minutes. Uh, I'm taking this to Fashion Place, something of the sort. Uh, I'll hit you with the name in the voiceover. Made it to Fashion Place West. Done with the blue line, done the entire blue line. Getting on the red line right here to Daybreak Parkway. Uh, when's it coming? Oh, the video board's so far away. Uh, well, it should be within the next 15 minutes. And um, then hopefully I can find a bathroom there. That would be ideal. Daybreak Parkway. Uh, I've gotten off the train rather than just immediately taking it back this time because uh, I'm gonna go check out if this library over here has a bathroom because I am like two hours ahead of schedule. I just had a really quick morning getting everything I needed to done uh, so plenty of time to find a good bathroom. All right, I've reached the, yeah, I'll drop my headphones. All right, I've reached the University of Utah Medical Center. Three hours in right now, almost to the minute, and I've finished the red and blue lines. 
I just look green line left as well as the the S line. The S line's like 20 minutes, the whole thing, uh, like to the end and back to where I need to be. Uh, and then the front runner, and that's what's gonna be the, the really long one. Yeah, gotta get back on the train because it's about to leave again. Central Point Station now. Just walking over from the red line area over to the uh, the S line over here. Yeah, oh, it leaves in nine minutes. Okay. Woo. Made it to the end of the S line, Fairmont, and now we're turning back. We're gonna get on the green line. I've made it to West Valley Central, the end of the green line, somewhere on there. The end of the green line. We're going to take the green line back to Central Point. Uh, get on, actually, I don't even know off the top of my head. Yeah, to Central Point. Get on either the blue or the red line there. Down to Murray Central. And that's where we'll the. That's where we'll get the front runner. Down to Provo. Uh, Provo back up to Austin. Uh But for now, gonna get back on the green line this leaves in like four or five minutes. Uh, yeah, Woo. moving along. Made it to Murray Central to get on the front runner right there. That's where it's gonna leave from uh, in about 45 minutes. So gonna walk around a bit uh, and just see What's around i really don't think there is much i think it's just these buildings and then a hospital over here and oh is that a gas station that's too far yeah ah, let's see what's up yeah never mind i forgot how bad my knee hurts now when i when i walk on it so just gonna go sit at the station Made it to Ogden. It's uh, really beautiful over here. The next train back doesn't leave for 27 minutes, so I'm gonna find caffeine because I need that more than anything right now. <laughs> I forgot about my leg. I went to go get a soda. I thought Red Bull was a bit much with the night I've got ahead of me, uh, which will, which is, which is a bridge that's gonna be crossed later uh, on the video. But I've completely forgotten about my knee. I went a little out of my own range to go get caffeine. What would normally very much be my range, but not, not my range right now. Uh, 
That's it. 11 hours and 15 minutes later, I've been to every rail station in Metro Salt Lake City. And this is actually the point where this video ends and the next one begins. So I will see you in the next one.